Thank you. Good, good morning and welcome to the first meeting in 2018 of the Rural Economy and Connectivity Committee. Could I ask members and all those present please to ensure that mobile phones are on silent. No apologies have been received for the meeting. The first item on the agenda is a declaration of interest and for this I need to welcome Colin Smith, a, a member of the south of Scotland to the committee. Colin is replacing Rhoda Grant. Colin, are there any declarations of interest that you would like to declare to the committee? Thank you very much, convener. The, the only interest that, that may be relevant um, are volunteer uh, declarations in my register. I'm a member of the GMB union, a member of Unite the Union, and I'm also the volunteer chair of a campaign group for a, a railway station at East Ricks. Thank you very much. And I'd, before I leave this item, I'd like to record officially the committee's thanks to Rhoda Grant for all the work that she put in to the committee. She attended nearly all of the meetings and certainly made a huge effort to get out to all the islands on the islands visit and to attend all the video conferencing calls that we did last year. So um, I think on behalf of the committee, we'd like to record our thanks for her diligence during the course of 2016-17. I'd like to now move on to agenda item two, which is a decision on taking business in private. The committee, I'd like to ask the committee whether it would consider taking an item on post-legislative scrutiny in private at a future meeting. Are, do members have any views on that? Stuart, you have views on that. Uh, uh, thank you, convener. I, I think on this occasion, um, we're not affecting uh, the interests of individuals, I think, in any discussion we have on this subject, nor do I foresee that this will be a uh, a particularly party-driven issue. Uh, so I think on this occasion, uh, it will give greater cred credibility to items when we do take them in private, that we take this one in public um, and uh, I'll allow uh, people who watch the activities of the committee to see our discussions on this subject, which I think will be pretty matter-of-fact in any event, convener. Okay, thank you, Stuart. I mean, the committee is always minded to take things in public when it can. So. I think, unless I uh, hear any dissenting voices, that it, we should agree that we should take this matter in public at, at the future meeting when it comes back. Are all members agreed? We are agreed. Thank you. The committee now, however, will move into private session to consider items three and four. Thank you. <laughs> 